Hi guys, today I'm going to be reading from a book titled Little Leaders, Bold Women in Black History. This book consists of stories about black women who have been leaders, who have been brave, and who have been bold throughout history. What makes these women so great is that they were true trailblazers. They directed and changed the course of history. They helped change the outlook or prospect for black people, people of color, and women. Florence Joyner Sprinter. Florence Joyner Sprinter. As a child, Florence loved to stand out, which wasn't easy growing up with ten brothers and sisters. Her mother was a model and her grandmother a beautician, so style and beauty were always a part of her life and often how she expressed herself. Her athletic talents emerged early on when visiting her father in the Mojave Desert, she caught a jackrabbit that tried to outrun her. By age seven, she was already winning races and she had a successful athletic career in high school and college. At California State University, Northridge, she met her longtime coach, Bob Kersey. By 1982, Florence was making a name for herself in the track and field world. She stood out as a superb athlete, but her personal style could not go unnoticed. On the track, she sported flashy uniforms, often ones that she designed herself, and long fingernails. In 1984, she participated in her first Olympics and won a silver medal. She took time off from running and worked other jobs, including bank representative and beautician. She married fellow runner Al Joyner whose sister Jackie Joyner soon married Florence's old coach Bob Kersey. With a family full of runners, she was encouraged to get back into competition. So she set her sights on the 1988 Olympics. She won one silver and two gold medals and set a new world record that she still holds to this day. She also picked up the nickname Flojo. Even with a successful athletic career, Florence had other passions and interests. She developed a clothing line and nail products, wrote children's books, and, ex and established a youth foundation. She would never be defined as one thing, and most certainly would always stand out from the crowd. Florence Joyner, Sprinter. Bye for now.